Hi guys, hello and welcome back to Montclair Island in Dinkum, where I'm kind of spending this morning working on what we started last stream from Montclair. I finally got my house moved here. I need to get a customization kit, obviously. Um, been fiddling with the shape. I think this will be big enough for a little patio. <laughs> um, I think I'm kind of committed to it now. I could move this, though, before I even start filling this in. This is what I want to do for kind of the hillside, sort of the natural vibe. We're going to plant, like, some different uh, trees and spin effects and little bushy things around there, just natural kind of stuff. I don't think I'll do flowers. It would be weird to have flowers there. Um, haven't decided what we're going to do along for fencing yet. I've got a lot of resources with me or I've got some fencing and flower boxes and stuff like that. Hey, nice. Um, also want to put, we're going to work on getting, I got a ute. We're going to work on building a little carport. I don't know if I want to fully enclose the carport. Yeah, the stairs are going to have to change a little bit or this just all becomes a wall right here. May have to change this up a little bit. I just added the stairs going up around the back side. Oh my gosh. I don't know why I keep having to dig up these X's, but they bug me if I don't. Yeah, I have put so much grass seed. <laughs> um, I've dirt printed it in. Oh, girl, I meant to do this. Where's my pathing? There we go. So we're going to play with this a little bit. And I know this is wide enough, though. I think I did it right for, if I'm not in the way, I think a pergola will fit in here. I'm in the way still. Yeah. So I could do, I don't know if I want one on each side or not, or if that's going to look a little busy. Could do that, though, then with some steps. I will be putting steps here. I just kind of left that as is for now. So maybe some steps and then flower boxes or something. Do we like the two pergolas? Maybe. I think that's going to work. Uh, oh, those are all the like plants and stuff I think I ordered. Yeah. Okay. Don't need to grab those now. I also want to show you guys one other thing I did and then we'll get started. Um... Oh, and I want to go get a custom... It's Sunday. I can't get a customization kit. I might have one. I really didn't like how this came out when we were doing this the other day. I like the idea of using water beds for planter boxes, but this just looks too, I don't know, stiff and weird and not good. So I started fiddling over here. I think I like this better. I removed the flower boxes and then added some of the lily pillies and then the smaller lily pillies. I want to add more of the smaller. I think I do. So I just wanted this to grow in just a little bit. So you guys can kind of see what we're doing here. Uh, oh, yeah, and I harvested my stiff with my, uh, my Harvac. Such a good tool. Uh, yeah, let's do some more of the small. Small guys. And I wasn't sure. I might get rid of the red... I'm bringing a different color. It did red and white because of the umbrellas, but I feel like it's too matchy. I almost want to get some of the purple or something like that. So I might fiddle with that. So maybe before we go, I also, though, before we go finish up the house, maybe do this on the other side and grab some other hibiscus to play with. But that's looking kind of cool. I think that's one side, because I got to wrap around that corner too in front of the carport a little bit. I think, um,. And on both sides, once we plant in some stuff, I think that's going to give me the little hillside vibe I'm looking for. And we'll put a little railing in front of the pergolas along the front there. A railing or flower boxes or something. So do I have more? I do. I have three more. Is that enough? Oh, it's just enough. I guess I knew how many I needed. <laughs> Love when a plan comes together. So I hope you all are doing very well. We'll be getting back into streaming my uh, Lollygag Island very soon. So what did I do? Let me see what I did over here. Okay, along the back. It's four of those along the back with the three 
Lily Pillies. Okay. I still can't believe how much luck we've had on Lollygag right off the bat. It's been so fun. I don't know if it'll continue. I feel like we're off to a good start on that island. Ooh, lots of sirens in the background. Nice, nice. Oh, gonna, gonna need gonna need to go grab more of the lily pillies, the small ones. And then I'll grab some of the hibiscus too. We'll play with some colors. Maybe we, we even want all four colors, make it really vibrant. That might be a bit much. I'll try it. But yeah, I've decided Montclair, I feel like this is just going to become more of a recorded series because I'm really at just the decorating stage and you all know how much I just struggle. Uh, I don't even know. Yeah, see, I think that's going to look kind of cool. And then there's going to be another house right behind it. Well, behind it at a little bit of a diagonal where I'm going to do that same hillside kind of vibe. Not sure I'm digging the pergolas. We might do something different than that. Uh, let's go get our seeds. So, yeah, this series will just slowly um, just be doing a little bit here and there as I decorate it. Decorate it. I did add the heath. I went through here and pulled out some of the ferns and added some of the common heath just because it's pretty. I've not been doing anything with my crab pots. Um, oh! Just to show you guys, though, to demonstrate, oh, I'm going to clutter up my bags here, but you can now <laughs> harvest uh, the crab pots. So we just got some jelly and I don't even know what else. Well, there were only three crab, four crab pots. There we got some jelly and something else. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I forgot that's where my wish fountain is. Oh, I have pergolas there, too. Let's stack those together. We're eventually... Uh, All right, we'll grab you and put you where you belong. Let's maybe... If I even see a few things that belong over at the garden center. Uh, we could swap a few things. Put some junk away here. And then put some other stuff away properly. Sure. <laughs> I am just the worst. I am the worst. I don't know why I'm looking through this right now. I know I need to go to the garden center, but I'm like, while we're here, let, let's see what we got that I can put away properly. Do we have any hibiscus? We do. Uh, do we have any more room to carry stuff? Oh, I've got a lot of hibiscus. Uh, let's put the trolley metal detector. I'm going to forget that those are in there and then wonder where the heck those are. Oh, actually, maybe instead of pergolas. Oh, I really wish I had <clears throat> the matching, but maybe we'll play with the umbrella. Um, Stick those in there for now. Those go away over by the nursery. Yes, I'm aware I could have done this before I started recording, but did I think to do it? No. <laughs> I'm not even worried about how to decorate the little patio and house and all of that yet. I'll put those keys with those for now. I've got I've got so much stuff just mixed and matched. We've got more of that. Hey, okay, let's go feed our doggos. Take care of that. Oh my gosh, what what a mess. What a messy mess mess. <laughs> okay. Also, I want to thank those of you who have been watching the members only series of Until Then. Oh, I thought I was missing a doggo. They were sitting one on top of the other. I was about to freak out. But yeah, thanks you guys for those of you who've been watching Until Then. It's a series I'm doing for our channel members of all levels. Um, I'm really enjoying it and I appreciate you leaving comments or letting me do know during the streams what you think of it. Um, I came through here also, uh, a little bit earlier today and planted all of these flowers in the little gum wood planters. That way they will stay there now when I harvest my honey with the vac. Because that was a little bit of an issue. 
Oh, look at all the flowers we've got coming in. I gotta harvest these. Yeah, maybe we want to mix in. I'll leave the yellow and red alone, but maybe we'll get some of the purple hibiscus. Let's put this stuff, all of this away that we can. So satisfying. Yeah, I don't think we're going to want the red. I, I think red was a mistake. Let's, yeah, let's go with these. I'm going to grab these. Uh, oh, and then we needed the little lily pillies. Let me grab more of all of those. Um, grab a little more grass seed just in case we need it. Then we've got that for later, that for later. I got my food buffs ready to go. Okay, that's a little more tidy. We can, we can work with this. So yeah, let's go work at the Tucker box just a little bit, and then we'll do a little shaping of the hillside. Hopefully I can get most of that done, and then uh, I'll be able to fiddle around with decorations and stuff. Oh, grass seed. Yeah, the red is just, I don't know, not doing it. I love the purple. That's so pretty. I think we can have purple. We don't have to match our umbrellas. That was just silly. Maybe put, I was thinking maybe putting some in these corners. At least a little bit. And then, oh, do I want to do more here? Can you reduce? I almost want to place items just to see how they look. See, this is a different shape. No, they're about the same. So then, yeah, then that. And then maybe a purple one here. And then the purple goes... Whoop. And then we do the lily pillies. And then we'll decide if we want to continue. Let's see, it's five, yeah, or four, four, right? Then we'll continue. If we want to see if we want to do any around the back. I might not, because there's not. Well, we do have room though for something along the back here. I just wasn't sure what to do. I could also just do more pathing, and have this be a lookout spot. That is an option. I mean, I could even be putting these in front of the trees. Maybe? No, no, because I don't like how it would go. Okay. I'm like, wait a minute, something's off here. Yeah, I could do white. Do white, then purple, then white. <laughs> I'm just trying to... I. I'm not always the most symmetrical person, but I do like things to kind of line up a certain way. I think I do would rather keep these trees here, though, than make room for the hibiscus. Yeah, I'm not even sure I like the little trailing hibiscus. We'll, we'll, we'll see. What if I put... Oh, and I can show you what I did. I forgot. We need to go... What did I need to go get? Anything from Fletch's? Maybe nothing. It's probably nothing. I added some more lights. Turkey, you don't belong up there. Added some more lights over um, by my resident services. That's that's not what we call it. That's Animal Crossing. The town hall. It looks a little better. I just every time I go over there, I like try and think of like one or two little things to fiddle. I think we're getting close, and then we're going to be adding though like a little path that leads. Uh, to like a little flower garden. That's a little ways off, but that's going to happen. I mean, that's all right. It's better than what we've had going. And then 
purple and then white. Hey, Sheila, how's it going? Just little touches here and there. Um, oh, shoot, you know what we could do is even maybe put some more lanterns. Oh, that's what I didn't do over here. I didn't dig out the spot for the lanterns. Um, I need to go get them. Okay, um... Pathing. So right there. See, the little X will drive me nuts until the end of times if I don't get that. I'll get it later. No. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, let me go get some more of those. Let me go get like two, four, maybe six of those. Oh, where are those? <laughs> it would be faster. Y'all, you know I have a bunch of these. I don't want to go get them right now. The garden. No, it's not the garden lantern stone. Sorry, I just I just don't want to go try and dig them out of my messy, unorganized storage right now. You guys don't need to see me do that. Already loving the purple hibiscus so much better. That's a way better vibe. So we could do the same over here. Just so we have a little more light around here at night. Might even do it behind those other trees. Uh, this one, right? Yeah. What's the matter, Sally? Do you not know where to go because I'm messing with all the pathing? You're just pacing. If I talk to you, will you stop pacing? Yep. Uh, hair is like nature's clothing. I turned my speakers down. They were way loud. And just like clothes, the way you style it can show off your personality. Well, mine right now would be showing the world I am a hot mess. Um, so I could stick a lantern maybe behind these trees here. Or we could even do it, well, we could do both. Let's do it here. Let's see how that looks. I, I might even dig that other one. I'm not going to dig it down. Do we want to just place it so it's the same height as that? I don't think so. I might have to change what we've got going on over there anyway. So now I feel like we need to build this up. All uh, right here. Shut it. I don't want to hear about it. <laughs> I'm not going to go running back and forth to chests when I have the materials. Uh, or when, um, when I'm recording. It's just, if it uh, takes too long. So yeah, maybe this side... I don't know yet, because I like that those lanterns are the same as what we've got going on on the other side of the bridge. I am oh, I could mix it up, though, and do something a little different. I don't know. I don't know. Starting to look a little better. Definitely looking a little more filled in. A little more, I don't know if lush is quite the right word, but uh, I'm liking it better. I'm trying to decide if we want anything here as far as lily pillies, maybe the tall lily pillies. We only know by doing it, right? Um, I can get rid of these. I can move the tables too in a little bit if I need to. Um, just to give us a little more room back here.
Yeah, let's do it on this side too. Just, I've been meaning to come fill this in. I just haven't known how I wanted to do it. Sorry for spinning you all right round, right there. I know those are a little off center, but not, I mean, I could put another big tree, do some more bushes. I'm almost wondering if I should get rid of these large trees and move the lilies. You know what? I think we're going to do that. Let's get rid of those. Uh, we're going to need you. That's what's throwing me off, because then we can move the, these over so it's a little more symmetrical. That just looks off to me. Unless I were to do another large tree here instead. We could do large trees there. Give a little more privacy. What do you guys think? You know what? I might like that idea. But I like this being kind of open though when you first walk in. So maybe not. Let me do it on one side. Let's tear this tree down on this side. Look, we can use our... Oh, it went in the water. So we can still use our... Oh, I don't have my helmet on. <laughs> there we go. Suck up our wood. I still haven't found that... Gl glider. I lost another glider. Did I put... Maybe I put my glider away? You all. Oh, no, it's here. <laughs> I was about to freak out. I'm like, how do I keep losing gliders? I still haven't found the one I lost. So we'll put, put this over here. That just looked weird. And then you guys. I don't have to alternate the colors. I'm just having some fun with that. Uh, maybe the small lily pillies then. I don't want. Mm. On this side, we're going to plant another large tree. That's what we're going to do. And then we're going to let that grow in. And I'll decide which I like better from there. Tempted to use the place item. Um... Yeah, we'll see which we like better that way. Uh, let's take this down. It's like we just planted those. Yeah, we'll do the two trees. And then I might move these lanterns down, which is why I didn't plant that, plant that right in front of it. I still might decide to move the trees over there, but I really like it. How I don't want that to be too closed off. So I think that'll work. Uh, let's put you here. Oh. Let's take that off. Hello, Erwin. I think that'll look all right. You know what? We're doing it. Uh, I'm placing an item. Uh, 38 for the blackwood tree. Because I really want to know now which I like better. Oops. I think I like the big tree. That gives that's way more of a Montclair vibe than the lily pillies. It's nice to know this now, and I don't have to wait a whole bunch a whole bunch of days. 
I went from apologizing to spawning in a few items that I already have created and I just don't want to get to, uh, yeah, we're just now placing items. It's, it's fine. I don't know why I feel guilty about that. I think it's because there have been some some people in the who get a little judgy about it, and so I still feel guilty about it, and I'm just not going to anymore. All right, let's go to sleep, see how this looks in the daytime, and then we'll go to work uh, on our hillside. So I want I want to get that progress going. Oh, I was going to put a little more pathing in the back, though. Yeah, I think we're good in the back here. I don't even know that I like these little scattered bushes, so those just might go bye-bye. So what if we just do this? And that way people can just come back here. Look at the water. I feel like now we may need to make this one wider. Just for a little more consistency. Could even do a little fencing or something around here. I don't know. That this is still it's still a work in progress. But I feel like every time it just gets a little bit better. Like even at night now, that's so much better looking with the lights and stuff. Alright, so let's go. I have a sleeping bag over here. Oh, I was gonna that's what I was gonna do. I want to see what these lights look like over here at night. I finally fixed my pathing right there. Um, we have more jacaranda trees, I think. I think I've added... No, I was thinking of adding some more. But we're going to have some more fun with place item. <laughs> it's, it's fine. Uh, 541. I was thinking, what if we put some... Just a couple more. Like, lined up with these pergolas. Should I do it? Let's see. Yeah, let's do it. Do it right here. I'm in the mood for instant gratification. <laughs> yeah, that helps. Because it was just looking a little naky right there. And then I had added the hibiscus here just to round out these corners. But it looked weird without having um, something on the end of it. So I've added some lamp posts that looks pretty at night um and then i just did the same thing over here so i thought we needed just a little more light over here now do i want to add jacarandas on both sides like in the back corner there and then go do the same thing over here on this one maybe not on the one that's in front just on the back side oh, wait did I, <laughs> did I have it right next to it or one away it was a tight fit I think it's right next to it yes I'm liking how this is looking. I love the jacarandas in spring. We're only going to have a few more days of them. See, that's another good reason to be doing the place item. So we can actually see what they look like. And then I still don't know what to do over with this spot. Oh, maybe our wish fountain. This will be a good spot over here to do something with the wish fountain. Okay, that'll be a good plan. We'll do a pretty little garden around the wish fountain. Hi, Theodore. I think this is looking really pretty. Yeah, next time maybe we do the Wish Fountain. I have to figure out how I want to decorate around it. Get the little doggo sleeping over there. We do have a big doggo den somewhere around here. This, I'm thinking this is where my little in-ground flower garden is going to be. Kind of behind the gazebo. I might fill in some... See, that's the problem, though. The river's right here. I'd love to center it behind the gazebo. But maybe we have a little trail. I have to figure out where it would start. Like, just a little path. Maybe it does come off of here. A little path coming off the museum that kind of winds back through here with a little trail with 
greenery and stuff. And then the little flower garden doesn't have to be really huge. It could just kind of take over this little spot. And then that kind of is opposite where the wish fountain is. All right, I think that's a good plan. I hope I remember that's the plan for that. Little doggo, you should go back to your den. I didn't destroy a den over here, I don't think. Oh, I might have actually. So yeah, I like how that looks. These are not very well lit. I want the taller lamps here. Sorry if you hear um, Tom and the doggo in the background. She's been a real mama's girl this this week. Last week, I swear, she was all about her dad. It was all about Tom. And this week, yeah, that's better lighting. It's more about mommy. <laughs> so I think she's upset I've locked her out of the office. So that's looking better. I still might change out the hardwood fence I have around. I was just putting it to see how I like it. Yeah, I think that works better. Uh, I love the lighting under those. I don't think we need the little ones here, though, do we? I don't think so. No. No. Nope, nope. Nope, because they have the little lamps on their tables. Nope. We're happy with what we got. Uh, since I spawned in those others, we'll compensate. We will delete those. Get rid of that. Uh, get rid of that. Okay. I know this is all over the place. We've started out with my hill. We went to the Tucker box, but now we've done this. This looks so pretty. I like this. I hope you like it too, Fletch. You gonna go have a little glass of wine? I wanna see if she's gonna go sit down. Fletch, we do not stand on the furniture. Sheesh. I'll tell you what. That's not allowed in my household. <laughs> Only because we don't have cats anymore. <laughs> no keeping them off. All right. All right, let's go. Let's go. We're going to need customization kit. Do I have one? I know. Um, 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 um. Okay. John's doesn't open till 8. I might have some over by my house. I can't stop looking at this because I just love these purple trees and they're like one of the most beautiful items in the game. Thank you, James. Doubt. <laughs> Doubt James is going to see this, but thank you anyway. Although you never know. Let's see how this is looking in the daylight. Yeah, that was a good call, um, putting the trees there. I think these lights should be down low, like the others. Oh. Is that going to be a problem with Krakos? Hopefully not. I hope not. I like that better. I don't think a Krako could get past there. We'll find out, won't we? Yeah. That way they're all the same level. I like that better. Um, I don't... I, I'm, yeah, I gotta figure out these corners. Maybe some spin effects tufts or something. Or some flowers. You know what? I'm picking those up. Those, those, That doesn't work for me. We'll do something later. I'll do it off camera. Um, just fiddle around with some flowers and stuff. I'll leave the little bushes in front. That's fine. But I, I don't like the way these are looking. Or we just have nothing. You know, not every space has to be filled. I've told that, told you guys that about me before. I'm the kind of person that I just don't need to fill every spot on my island with, with stuff. It starts to look cluttered to me. But maybe some flowers or something. Maybe just on these corners? Maybe just like that. We'll just do those. Yeah, let's just do that. Oh. Oh, wait, no. Is my spacing different on both sides? It might be. 
No, I think that's... I think that's right. Okay. That's how you can tell whether you've done a place right. Yeah, I think that's good. I'm happy with that. All right. John's is open now. <laughs> We're going to have a very fresh turkey for dinner if uh, Sheila feels like it. Got a little turkey that's been running around the yard for days. I think that looks so much better. Okay. All right, let's go get a customization kit. Hopefully there's one. If not, I'm pretty sure I have one stashed away. I don't know what I want the house to look like yet. I just want to have it. Take it. I want to get rid of the hedge around our house, if nothing else. All right. Okay, so let's do... That's right, I was thinking maybe instead of using... Um, those pergolas, we might... Gotta eat. Uh, do, like, just a little table and chairs with an umbrella. Let me do a little more of this. Because this is going to be going around... I just want these to be kind of different heights. I want to have kind of a random look. It's kind of hard for me to build something and make it look random. I'm trying. That's where Tom would say, yeah, you are. You are trying. <laughs> so I'll keep going along. I'm going to have to compact this a little bit, get some of it out of the way. But that way, this way, we're going to have plants and bushes and stuff throughout here just to give it a natural lush vibe. So, oh, dang it. Go away. Don't want your poop. Okay, let's start doing this. Got to figure this out. Um, let's put, I think I want it two pergolas deep. Nice. I think that'll be a good size. Probably put, oh, do I want cement pathing under it? I didn't even think about what pathing I want on the outside either. Let's just get the walls built up and then we'll figure it out from there. And I'm probably going to have to fiddle with the stair shape a bit as well too. So I might actually even want to build the wall. Because this then maybe should just go this the same height, right? Because otherwise I'd be kind of weird. So I guess this then I'll maybe just like that. And then do I need to do... That's a bit odd. I don't know. That might be a bit odd. I don't know. Oh, that's that's weird. I could put some planter boxes or fencing right there. But if you're coming up the stairs... Should this be the same height as, uh, or is it? That's up one higher. All right, we're going to have to fiddle. This has to be level with this, though. But we could do... I'm not sure. Oh, how unusual. I'm not sure about something. I don't really want this to be... That might be looking weird. I don't know why I'm doing that. Should that go up one higher or be level with? Hmm. No, that's one of those finishing touches. I won't really know, I don't think, until we start adding uh, more stuff. Because I thought maybe we would just go to that level. Yeah, I don't want to... Although those don't have to be the exact same. Let's let's just we'll we'll figure that out later. I think I want this enclosed like more of a garage feel than um than a carport. Well this is still kind of a carport feel. I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm just rambling. I'm tired, y'all. 
It's been like a really long and emotional week. So I'm just, I'm tired. I think just too deep is good. I haven't paid in my ute yet. I think that's good. I'm probably put just the cement path down. And coming up the stairs is good. I, I, I think I'm okay with these big different levels. I could build it all up one level, but I want I want some variety. I think that's all right. And we're gonna need more. I'm gonna pick these up for now. Cause I don't I don't know that I love these. No, you know what? We're gonna leave them till we've put other stuff around. That was my original instinct was to use that. So and then we'll just play with this a little bit. Nope. Didn't want that. You there? Oh my gosh, we're almost we're in the twenty third. I I heard the music. I'm like, wait, it's not like Arwick Day, is it? No, <laughs> not Arwick Day. Arwick was my other island. It would be Montclair Day. I'm not sure how far I want the tree part of this to go. Cause, oh, we're gonna have to do pathing. Um. for uh, 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 the driveway, too. We need to cut this in. Where does that go? All right, so we're going to stop that there. Let's do a little... Do that one tall. Do that there. A little bit of this. Sure. Just to cut... It, it should hopefully look more natural. Let's go to our workshop. Which is this away? No, this away. <laughs> oh yeah, you have a ute. Oh, we'll get some paint for the ute. I think all my pathings put away. I didn't make more, did I? Oh yeah, we ran out of it last time, and I didn't make more. Y'all, I suck. I guess I'll paint it. Let's paint it green. I want to see what it looks like green. Shoot. Shooty, shoot, shoot. Got a lot of that. Let's, let's see what I can make. Do I have cement? I don't think I even have the cement. Not sure if I'm gonna use this or not. You all, it's fine, it's fine. Um oh, I wanna cab grab the cabin drawers. I don't know if I have those. Uh let's just I'm gonna just stick these in my auto sorter for now just to get them out of my way. Uh same with this stuff. The thing is, I have the resources to make all the things. I just forgot to make all of the things. That's the sad part. And I'm unorganized. Yeah, I'm really liking how that's looking. That's giving me that kind of Oakland Montclair vibe. I'll prob I will probably change this to red or blue. Oh, you know what? I kind of like the green. All right, let's uh, sit. Oh, let <laughs> drive. I just got rid of the pergola. Awesome. Scooch. <laughs> That's all right. I need to pick it up to do the path. I really am going to keep the um, lollygag. I am only going to be 
playing that island while I'm on stream, and I really, unless some horrible catastrophe strikes, I don't know what that would be. I am planning on... Oh, it's a bit there and not smooth. <laughs> I am only planning... I'm not... That's going to be a vanilla island. That's what I'm trying to say. Because I really do enjoy the grind of the game and the making the resources. Like, I love just sitting there making cement bags. So here we could even consider switching to something else. Um, I enjoy this part of making all of this, the resources and stuff. So I do get a little bit annoyed when I don't have it for use for when I'm recording. I just don't always remember to get everything I need. I really liked how Jersey and I did my hill. So not, well, it's kind of a hillside build. My house build on my other island where we used a mixture of the green and the hardwood. That's what I'm kind of doing here a little bit. We're going to be mixing this stuff up. It's like I thought to get railings and gates crafted and other stuff crafted, but I didn't get all of this done. The other option would be... You know, actually, let me dig some of this up. Would be to try the smooth cement... Oh, I need to eat another spark and soup. Um, or we keep going with what we used for the garage. Well, this might work too. I'm going to do it differently for each house. So like maybe I'll use, if I don't use the mossy brick here, and just go smooth cement, which i now kind of leaning towards, um, then maybe I'll use the mossy brick on one of the other houses. There's going to be a total of four hillside houses. Yeah, let's mix it up. Oh, let's just get this stuff up, too. Don't be grass seeds. <laughs> Stupid grass seeds. <laughs> well, look, more grass seeds. Hmm. Who could have predicted I would have done something quite like that? So, yeah, whatever I don't use on this build, I'll be using on others. I think that was a sentence I was saying and then didn't finish. Huzzah. Oh, I get so distracted. And then that with the hardwood railing. I think that'll look good with some hardwood railing and planters. I, I sort of like the idea of using something different just for the garage part. Let's get rid of the green. I am not feeling the green at all today. Normally, love it. Today, I'm like, mm-mm, no. Don't need you in my life right now. I don't know why. The house customization will be the last thing we do. I don't know that we're even going to get this done because we're, we're a little bit into it. You know what I'd love to hear from you guys? And I should probably put, a, put up a poll. Do you prefer that I keep videos, these recorded videos I do, Closer to, because I've always tried to keep them shorter, <laughs> like less than an hour, like maybe that 45 minute mark. Would you prefer that they're that, that length or do you want a longer one just because you're playing games and you're mostly just listening along while doing your own thing? So it's nicer to just, I want this deeper. I don't think, I meant wider, but no, I don't think so. So I'd love to know, do you like it hour plus? Or around that 45 minute sweet spot. I keep forgetting to ask that. Okay, let's see how this is looking. Oh, steps. What do we want the steps to be? Uh, I also need to go get the steps. <laughs> I realized I cut in the steps and then didn't get the steps. I kind of like the mix of those two, though. And then maybe this is hardwood here with this around the perimeter. Let's 
So yeah, I'm going to need to make a lot of cement. We'll see how the fencing looks there, if that's what I want to do, or if I just want to build up a one level higher and just use this as our, our little wall. Like, I, I know a lot of people whose houses I would visit, my friends and stuff from school. We didn't have fencing around here. This would have been a built-up wall, not a little little wood fence. But that doesn't mean that's what I have to do. But it would be very kind of standard or typical for this area. And then the fencing maybe just down around the uh, deck. I was going to go get something very specific and I've already forgotten what. All right, what's in the way? Probably me. I could even put some other pathing or something for little windows, but I'm not sure how I feel about that. I think it'll work. So where do we want then this? Actually, it wouldn't be cobblestone. Eh, maybe we'll do it anyway. Normally it would be your driveway, not asphalt. But some people have asphalt driveways. Should this be four wide so you have room to turn? Mixed feelings. Oh, the steps. I was going to go get steps. <laughs> We're in it now, y'all. We are in it now. I knew something was looking wrong with my steps. I'm like, what am I missing here? Oh, the actual steps. Oh, shoot. Shooty, shoot, shoot. Because of the pergola... Well, and I don't want to use the place item command for these. I probably shouldn't have even been doing it for... Oh, that looks bad. That doesn't look good. Um, for those of you who've been using the place item with the pergola to then place the pergola and stuff under it, it can corrupt your game file. Trying to decide how I feel about this. Oh, shoot. That's a bit of an issue, though. And this should probably be out one longer anyway. I think we need to make this a little bit bigger. I, I might do it anyway and risk it. <laughs> Oh, yay, yay. All this for a little garage and it's not even a cute one. <laughs> I even built that up? I didn't. I just picked it up and put the stuff back down again. Brilliant. So that's, yeah, that's, that's weird. We need to do something a little bit different there. I mean, should I be wider or not? Put something else there. Let me just fiddle with this shape a bit. I didn't even think this part through. That would mean this would have to come down though. I'm just thinking to make room for the little turn. 
it should go up here and then curve there. Shovel. Oh, I gotta just shovel this out. I do wish we could use the compactor and the dirt printer while standing below it. Yeah, I didn't think that through when, with the stair placement, so that, that works better. But then I'm either going to have to place the gazebo or not use it at all. Or we could do bridges. I could lose the gazebo and just do bridges like I've seen like on Reaps. I've seen shenanigans do it, I'd probably on Reaps stream. Do I want to build that up there? Or do we want this to be a little landing? Poor Moxie. She just doesn't know what to do. So we could put a little, some floor lights there or something. We could even put some plants or something there. Not plants. What do we have that's like looks like something that would be in a garage? Like I can instantly think of a few things in Animal Crossing that would look like garage stuff, like gas cans and things like that. I mean, brick's what usually is used. I don't know that I'm going to like the way that looks, especially with, with everything else. I'm not even sure what size. I got the hardwood just because we've got hardwood going here. Wait a minute. Oh, is that not the same height? Oh, we got to make that the same height. Well, that answers that question then on how high it should be. But that's okay, because without the pergolas, even with the pergolas, it could be up one higher. It's fine. We could just try that in one spot, see if I like it before I change it up everywhere. Um, I don't even need to put the cement down yet. Why? Is it because of the steps? It's because of the steps, isn't it? Yeah. Why am I struggle bus? Oh, because I didn't make that. So it's the steps. So maybe we have to have a garage wall with a little... Okay, I gotta, let's sleep on it. I gotta rethink this shape. Um, because I can't have the steps in there unless we just do the place item. You know what? I think we're gonna risk it with the place item. Let's get rid of these bridges. Risking it. So I really want the steps in there. I just forgot that... That can't be a thing. Now, was that one supposed to be this? I can't remember which was which height. <laughs> well, and I know it's dark. We're going to sleep in just a minute. I'm going to... I'm going to do it. I'm sorry. Don't try this at home. Don't glitch out your games. I need to put one down so I know what it is. Debug. Seven one eight. Not sure which corner. And also where to put it. Okay, I'm gonna stand over here. Nope. 
Okay. Oh, that's kind of interesting how that did that on the little steps. Oh, I'm really risking my island now, aren't I? All right, let's go to sleep. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't just corrupt my game. <clears throat> Seriously, though, you guys be very, very careful if you do that. Make sure you have backups. I, I do use that one software that Offending Commit has a video on uh, that does automatic backups for your dinkum. I don't know why I can't think of the name of it right now. Uh, we have info on it in our Discord. Yeah, I kind of like that. I think that's that's okay. So yeah, unfortunately, the only way to get that is by cheating it in, spawning it in, however you want to say it, but it clips in really nicely. I understand why you can't do it, because, you know, it's one item per tile, and we're now putting more than one item on a tile, and I'm guessing that's what can cause problems. I would only have me to blame for this if anything were to go wrong. Really, Jackaroo? Really? I like it though. I think that's a nice little carport. Okay, let's play. We're going a little longer on this one. I'm not going to wait for any input yet. We're just going to go long. <clears throat> yeah, I'm okay with those big different heights. So what do we want to do along here? Let's see what we've got. We've got hardwood. We've got that. I do love how when you use the gates, it really connects nicely as opposed to the fence, you have a gap. And that's why people, I think we learned this, did we learn this from Benny? I learned it from Jersey and I think he learned it from Benny. Yeah, I think I just want to use that all around right now. Whoop! <laughs> and just on those sides like that. Oh, okay, Jackaroo, you gots to go. The inventory. I forgot the wood steps, too. I know I made them. That's what's so annoying. Not just my whining when I said I know I made them. Sorry, but I also need to feed Ozzy and PJ. Now, do I want it over here too? I think so. A little, yeah, that's kind of consistent. And then you come around, and we've got all of this room, too. We could put a little sitting area back here. So if I didn't use these pergolas... Yeah, I was thinking, let's do the fencing, and then maybe... Does that connect? Okay. Maybe we do flower boxes in front. I could even do flower boxes all the way around. I want to see how this is just looking from the front before I go too much further. Do I want to bury these in or have them up high? I kind of like how those stick out a bit from the uh, fence. I think I'm okay with the pergolas. I'm going to change the shape and color of my house, so don't forget about that. Let's see how it's looking from over here at the Tucker box. I think that's looking kind of cool. That's giving me the kind of vibe I'm wanting. Wanting. <laughs> well, I have the laziest teas. Wanton. <laughs> yeah. 
And since I've given up on going back and forth to storage, uh, I don't know if I want to play with a couple of these. Do I have room? I, would, I don't think I have room. I'd have to make this bigger. Oh yeah, we need the steps too. I might dig this back a little further to give us a little more room. You know what? Let's do that. I've given up on, ugh, just not, I uh, just, yeah. <laughs> ugh. Apparently we're just dev commanding in everything now. I tried to be good. I'm like, what do I need? Oh, you need the hardwood, this and that. You need the pergolas, you need the ute. Took the time to get all of that stuff together and then just forgot so much other stuff that it's like, yeah, it's just forget it. Otherwise, you're just going to watch me run back and forth to storage. And I don't want to pause it every time I have to do that. So then I forget what I'm doing. It's like walking in the kitchen and forgetting what I walked into our kitchen for. I didn't really leave a step, I just realized anyway. Um... I'm sorry, I'm thinking. Because <laughs> what if we put this there and then put the pergola? Oh, not wood fence. I'm like, where'd my pergola go? I love that those are the same color wood as well. Oh no, look what that did to my gate. James, why? Could we not have everything connect to the things? Okay, I guess that goes on the other side. <laughs> I get why that happened. I just don't appreciate, I just, I don't like it. So I'll put you back where, oh, back where you were. No. Okay, let's stand here. Oh my gosh. Okay. Uh, rotate, so you guys are facing the same direction. Oh, we need pathing too under that. I didn't put pathing on that side. And then if we do it on this side, which is fine. Gives you a little privacy from the house, I guess. That's pretty. I like that. No. Moxie. Yeah, I wanted it more on the front, but we'll just have to have it on the back. That's fine. I don't think I want to put it on the other, on the inside either. And I want these to go be dug back a little. I think so. Do three wide, I think. I swear to God, if this is another grass seed that's just decided to pop up, <laughs> it's like I dirt printed them down low and they're just slowly making their way up to the top, aren't they? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna put this here. Gotta fix our step situation here. And then do. Oh, then what do we do? Do planters maybe behind there? Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, I think that's a good, that, that's good. And then for this, let's see.
kind of like them tall like that. That gives a little a little privacy, but is then also a nice height from this side. So let's put the pathing under there. And I gotta put pathing on the other side. Oh my god, did I just compact that? I did. I don't know what my brain is doing today. I'm telling you guys. I, I was very tired today. Probably wasn't the best day to do this. But I was getting kind of inspired. <clears throat> I was just fiddling around a little bit this morning. Playing, you know, crafting some of the stuff I knew I need. And I thought, you know what? Let's just do it. Let's just record it. Okay, so I don't like how that's doing this at this end. But I don't... Oh, I know. That's why. Because we need to put this back. We do need this to be one higher right here. That solves that problem. Can I slip the pathing path under the fence? No, that's fine. I do like this mix though of this new cement path. That's another item I really have been enjoying with the last update. Okay, so that makes that fit in nicely without connecting to the pergola. Yeah, okay, I'm kind of feeling this. I won't be able to place any tea. I might have to use the place item again because I really want to put some furniture under those. Y'all, I am taking quite the risk, aren't I? I'm going to do it. I want it to look good. If it gets corrupt, we'll have the memories of how it looked for a very short period of time. Right? Except if I place it there, it's going to go behind where I don't want it, right? Let's see what happens if I do it here. Okay. Stop. <laughs> I know this is a really dumb risk. We want it to look pretty. Oh, I put it in the wrong area. Oh, I forget how to remove it. I should just be, I thought I could just pick it up. I have to find the right corner. <laughs> See? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. There we go. <laughs> So nothing can go in this corner, which is a little bit of a bummer, but it'll be all right. I was happy not having something in that corner. Okay. Let's go see what furniture we have that we can put there, maybe. Or do I want to do the tree? Maybe we do the tree part next. Maybe we save this for the next episode. I just realized how long we've been going. I can plant the trees off camera. That'll be fine. And yeah, I might actually just go ahead and place them. Um, I'm gonna eat some spark and soup, clear some of this away. Uh, we're gonna have to figure out too, we started to do the road, it's gonna go back. That's right, I was going to the towers and figuring out what could be at each tower. Do you know I've already forgotten? <laughs> so we'll be checking that out soon too. So yeah, we've got the roads going to go back here. Um, back around this area is where I'm going to kind of copy what I've been doing over here, only even taller. And one of the guest houses is going to go back there. I think it's going to be pretty cool. And then I think I'll do the other two houses on the other side of the road. 
so sort of a mirror image just not completely exact we will place you know what do we want to place play with the house customization kit while we're here too before i start because now that i know what colors we're using except for the accent colors we'll go up our stairs let's let's work on this really fast i should check all my mail oh that's way too much to grab that's right Customized house, yes. Do I want it to be like my Montclair house where it was, um, we had a flat top roof. We had a flat roof, that's what I'm trying to say. We had this, uh, mm -mm. <laughs> it's not right. It looks like a shop. It's kind of cool, but not quite. Oh, what colors? You know, hold on, I'm pulling up a screenshot I have I'm not gonna show you guys um that i took the other day it was like a reference photo oh is the house picture in here somewhere okay i did brown with the green all right um exterior let's do main color that's very brown trim but maybe instead of i kind of like the idea of a green uh, that might look kind of good. Now, which roof? I feel like that would look weird, that direction. That's a barn. That's kind of fun. I might do that for one of the guest house. That's kind of fun too. I've not seen it in action though, so I don't really want to commit to that. My childhood home is like a light mushroom color. I can't remember what color trim. I think it was brown. I don't know. It's not that it was the prettiest. Now, do I want the windows to match the shape of the door? See, I wish... I might just go with that door, because I don't like the curved... I don't like that door, too. I've never seen it. I wish you could get a better, like, rotate it. I want to rotate it. I feel like that round, I'm gonna go with it because I like, I think I like these windows the best. Oh, those could work too. I mean, those work as well. That mimics the shape of the door. Yeah, let's just do that. And then I don't think we want anything around it. I love that we now have that option. I probably won't like this and I will be getting another kit. But yeah, I think that's all right. I know that looks really brown on brown, but we're gonna be bringing in some other stuff to brighten it up. I gotta figure out what I wanna do around the house too. I'm actually, I think we're gonna plant some trees up here too. Definitely gonna plant some trees up here, so that'll be fun to do. Let me go fly over to the Tucker box and we'll get a good look at just the shape of this from a distance, see how we like it. Hi, Sheila, don't mind me. Yeah, I think that shape's looking pretty cool. Part of me is a little tempted to dirt print a bigger house. I haven't done that yet. I like to be able to go into the house though and all of that. Um, I might lighten the house color a little bit. Let me go grab, see if John's got another customization kit. So we'll fiddle, I'm gonna fiddle with that. Um, next time before I start my recording, just before I save, I'll start a new day. Customize the house. And if I don't like it, just exit without saving. That way I don't have to keep buying these and fiddling with them. Because we're at the end of the day now. But yeah, I'm very much enjoying this. So we're going to be compacting down a little bit. Uh, getting the second hillside built. It's going to be taller. We're going to fill in trees and bushes and things along here. Probably do a little bus stop on the corner. So yeah, I think this is a good place to end it. You guys, thank you. So Oops, did you just, do I have my display capture on? You've been seeing all of that kind of stuff. I suck. I have to do display capture for the until then recording. 
I can't do it for um for some reason it just won't record like I do all my other games uh in OBS. So I forgot to switch it from display capture to game capture because oopsies. So anyway, sorry you kept seeing that window pop up. And we'll just see you on the next episode and you're going to see it again. I'm so sorry. Yikes. I'm a loser. <laughs> Bye, guys.